Jade's Devil on the left of the leading group as they come down to the second. Jade's Devil and Charlie's Cottage from Widden for Warn and on the inside races Refino. So the back marker is Pottstown and last but one is Homewood. And last but two is Windbreaker as they race award to the away to the third. And Valley West has come up there now in the jockey wearing the white cap. But just half a length behind Charlie's Cottage who leads. So it's Charlie's Cottage and Valley West and then in third is Jade's double four is for Warren five Refinosa and their mid-division a mistake was made by the call specialist Jaden Diamond who lost three or four lengths having jumped that flight of hurdles Mercy Less makes a bit of ground on the outside and really struggling now in arrears as Pottstown as they race away to the next and it's Charlie's Cottage the leader as they come to the fourth from for Warren in second and then Valley West is now third Jade's double is fourth Pottstown just jumping it in fifth, yeah, in, in last place I should say, as they go to the fifth. And Charlie's Cottage the leader from for Warren. And Merciless has made up good ground on the very, very wide outside as they swing to go up the hill. It's still Charlie's Cottage in the lead from for Warren in second, Valley West third. Merciless losing just a little bit of ground on the very wide outside. Woodsinger begins to pick up ground. And then behind these comes Refinosa and Polar Star. So it's Charlie's Cottage in the lead from Forwarn in second, then Merciless third. On the inside, Valley West forward. A measure makes ground opening bars. And uh, Windbreaker has made up quite a bit of ground too. That's also racing wide. Very similar colours to Merciless. And at the rear of the field, British Crown and Jockey Party Company. And now it's Windbreaker who goes into the lead as they continue their result. And there's the uh, Walsh National result. Run and skip the winner, Golden Tide, 101. Good grief, second, come be third, and right hand man back in fourth place. So it's still Windbreaker in the lead from in second place for Warren, getting close. Then uh, Woodsinger races in third on the inside, Charlie's Cottage in four behind these opening bars, and then comes Winter Measure. Just seemed to lose his footing there. And Windbreaker quickens and goes on as they turn into the home straight. It's Windbreaker now pick it up and gone clear of the field from four Warren in second and really the race now has uh, opened up as they come down to the last windbreaker from four Warren. then comes polar star opening bars refinos of the gray under pressure but trying to close as they come down to the final flight it's windbreaker in the lead from in second place refinos who's closing then Polar Star making ground in the blue on the right of the picture. Over the last, and Refinosa has now has quickly come through to take up the running from Windbreaker, but Windbreaker rallies and stretches out in most determined fashion. Opening bars, finishing left, tricks chased by a loose dog, and uh, that's uh, hampering that, but Windbreaker's going to win at the post. Windbreaker is the winner. Windbreaker the winner from in second place, opening bars. Third came a Greyhound, fourth came Refinosa. Then behind these, Polar Star, and after that one came for Warren. And after for Warren came Homewood, and behind Homewood, Valley West.